Hello everyone! Today we're going to show you how to professionally edit your images using the Instruct image feature inside Project Dream. This tool enables a lot of fun ways to transform still images using natural language. Let's jump right in. We will go to the Instruct image panel using this icon. You'll see the settings on this tool are very minimal, but don't be fooled. There is so much potential in it if you learn to prompt correctly. On the top, we will see the image models available. We have marked the recommended models for ease of use. Depending on which model you're using, the generation time, credit cost, and final output resolution may be different. Extract Image uses models like Nano Banana and Seed Dream Edit 4 to understand your intent, even if your prompt is not descriptive. Think about it as if you were talking to a fellow artist. Instead of the usual descriptive style prompting, we will use an instructive prompt to guide the generation. You can input up to three images with your prompt. Having multiple aspect ratio input images may create unpredictable outcomes. We will see some workarounds for this on this video. You can ask it to change the time of day or the season of the image. I'll show you a quick example. I'm going to create one variation with light in golden hour and another in winter season. You can also include reference images to match on the final output. Here we have used the lighting, hues and contrast from the reference. We can also remove elements if we want, like removing people on this image. Another cool example is that you can easily replace specific furniture pieces. For easier control of parts of the image, we can use the Photoshop plugin for Project Dream. Let's mask the element that we want to swap and send it back to Project Dream. Now we will ask for the specific action we need. After that, we will send it back and it will load as a smart object inside your Photoshop file. You can import as many AI generations as you want for each specific smart object, and they will get stored as layers inside Photoshop. We can also ask the tool to change the fabrics using a reference. And if you want to swap a color, try to use specific color codes. Instead of asking for blue fabric, we can ask for a Pantone, Hex or RGB color code. We can do the same for people. Let's ask for a blonde woman sitting on this couch. We can also add as a reference the specific person we want to add on the image. And if we need to, we can also change the outfit. If we want to add a specific character, we just need to create a new prompt asking to add it in the scene. The image model will keep consistent details and adjust the lighting and position of your character. Now that we have him here, let's send him back to Photoshop. If you want to render a new image from a viewport, Instruct Image won't modify the input too much. The workaround is to change your viewport into a pencil drawing. After that, let's fit the pencil drawing as an input and ask to create a realistic image. This is our final result. Let's try something more complicated. We are going to add furniture to this image following this mood board that we received. Just add your command and see the magic happen. If your image aspect ratio gets altered, do not panic. Nano Banana will keep the same aspect ratio as the last image you attached. To fix this, just swap both input images. Here is the final result. We will use the same approach to populate this restaurant with furniture and people. After a few iterations, we can create all the elements of our image inside Project Dream. With Instruct Image and Photoshop integration, you can work with layers using one edit at a time to achieve the desired result. This workflow is non-destructive, and you will have all your iterations inside the Photoshop file. Just be careful that the final resolution is enough for your image. Some models like Nano Banana have a 1K output limitation, so it's a good idea to send the results to the Creative Pop Scaler first and then import them back into Photoshop. For these examples, we have used the Creative Pop Scaler feature inside Project Dream. With this new tool on your belt, you can modify your images to the last detail, from quick cleanups to full scene redesigns. There are no limits to your imagination. Until next time, Happy dreaming!